Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Mystic Moonbeam Tarot and today I'm doing a collective fire screen reading for you all. I'm also going to be pulling some additional messages from my handmade cards at the end of the session. See if I can clarify the messages that I see with the flame or just get some additional messages for you all. So if you'd like to sit back and relax, oh, I need to say as well, it is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. So as always, just take what fits and leave the rest. I'm going to get started straight away. So if you'd like to sit back, relax, and I'm going to see what I can get for you. I'm hearing cherries. This could mean something to someone. I don't know if someone's got cravings for cherries or something regarding cherries. I'm hearing cherries. I was seeing something then as well and it's gone. So I don't know if someone's seen something. It could be seeing something out the corner of your eye and when you look it's gone. Or it could be someone putting something down and then when you go to get it it's not there. Something about that energy. I'm picking up like a trickster energy. Someone playing tricks. I'm also seeing what looks like a face mask over someone's eyes. I don't know if this is like a, a daily routine to freshen up someone's eyes or someone's having some kind of light therapy for their eyes. This could be laser treatment or some kind of light therapy. I'm seeing the number 27 and 23. They, those could be dates. Initial A. The 20, I feel the 23rd of a month is going to be important on something that's ripe for the picking, is what I want to say. Especially when we've seen um, uh, Hearing Cherries, sorry, to, when I started. Something's going to be ripe for the picking. It's around the 23rd. It's like sweetness will be coming into someone's life. I'm also seeing a lot of boxes as well, so I don't know if... Um, Someone's packing up. Someone could be packing up to leave or there's a, a move that's happening for someone. I'm hearing the number 17. I don't know why, but I want to say 17,000. That could mean something to someone. I don't know if someone's going, um, making that amount of money or got that kind of money coming towards them. 17, 17,000. That could mean something. I'm also picking up on someone's letting go of something or you need to. I see a, a breaking away from a toxic or unhealthy situation. I'm hearing July the 14th. I'm also hearing the name Jenny or Jenna. There's something that needs taking apart. In my mind's eye, I'm seeing like the game of Jenga. It's like pieces need to be moved carefully so something doesn't come crashing down or collapse. Something will need to be done in bits or piece by piece. I'm seeing tomatoes. Tomatoes, they're associated with matters of the heart and also love magic. I know tomatoes can be used in spells or rituals aimed at attracting love or to increase passion or even strengthen existing relationships. Someone needs to put um, a, to a tomatoes or a, a single tomato on their altar for their deities or their ancestors to attract love it could also be there's magic between two people where there's a lot of passion as well i mean in tomato juice i don't know if someone drinks tomato juice or someone will start drinking tomato juice Or it could be that tomato juice may be added into someone's diet or someone will be adding tomato juice to their diet or you need to. Someone could also be doing love magic on another to strengthen their relationship as well. Something about love matters to the heart and love magic. 
But if you're not doing that um, and you have an altar for your ancestors, place a tomato there because they do represent love and matters of the heart and it will attract love towards you. I do feel that someone has feelings for another and you would never have guessed it or thought it. So there could be a shock for someone regarding romantic feelings being expressed. I'm hearing a very old song playing in my head. Um, we have Spirit on the jukebox today. Oh, what's it called? I shall link the song down below in the description box. It's a very old one. Um, it's Only Make Believe. I think it's by a country and western singer. I'm not sure. I shall find it and link it in the description box below. Listen to the words. They're going to mean something to someone. I mean, in August the 15th, that could be important or it will be. Someone could also be seen 1212 on a digital clock as well. Look up the meaning for that. I mean, snap. I don't know if someone's had enough with regarding another person or a situation because I'm hearing snap. I don't know if someone's, someone could snap and there could be outbursts of anger or emotions. I'm also smelling cakes as well. Um, I don't know if someone is baking or likes to bake, but I smell uh, fresh baking like someone baking cakes. There's going to be news of travel for someone as well. I'm seeing the initials J and B in a name. The numbers 312 and the number 19 and a hook. I'm here in court. Someone could be trapped in a situation that may be hard to get out of or someone needs to be careful not to get trapped or caught in a situation that it's going to be really, really hard to get out of. You need to be careful. There's also a fortune that's coming someone's way as well. I do see something about an expansion and a new start. There's also new connections coming the collective's way as well for some of you. You could be making new friends, new social groups, new social settings. Now, I do need to say, if anyone's been going through a separation with another, I see this coming to an end really soon. Two people are going to be reunited after a separation. There is a completion that's showing in a new beginning, and it could be around the months of September is what I want to say, that this happens. There will be change for the collective. And these changes the collective will have to embrace. You need to keep pursuing your goals with confidence as well. You need to trust in the universe and your spirit guides because they do have your back. They are supporting you. I feel someone's life is about to change in a really big way. Initials K, A, V and D could be anywhere first, middle, surname. I'm hearing when the leaves bloom. This could be when these changes take place. I mean, where I live at the moment, um, we've just got the seedlings coming onto the trees. There's no leaves yet. They're, they're just opening up. Something about when the leaves bloom. Time for change. You need to get ready. I'm hearing salty. There could be people around you that, that are salty towards you. You need to ignore it. I'm also seeing a bright pink flamingo as well. And something about self-expression and prosperity. But they also represent love as well. Someone could live in South America or be taking a holiday or a vacation to South America or someone wants to go to South America. be where flamingos are i'm sure that's south america mexico that could mean something to someone 
Someone could want to go to South America or Mexico, or there is going to be a trip taken, or somebody actually lives there that's watching this. Something about prosperity, self-expression and love. But flamingos, they don't uh, they represent someone not wanting to be alone. They they crave solitude, but they don't like being alone. So this could mean something to someone. I'm gonna get into the cards and just put this candle out. So I don't like to leave it lit because the cards end up jumping on it will have a fire. Right, I'm gonna do the big cards first. They have been shuffled so let's have a look i'll get some messages for the collective please self-sabotage needs to stop messing things up so someone could be self-sabotaging something someone could be messing something up we've got a no is the answer to your question i'm going to clarify these so let's just get them out someone could be asking a question you're being told no then we have two-faced talk behind your back. I've seen that with the candle flame as well. Cleanse your aura and your space. Someone's been strung along or used and charmed. Or someone's thinking that they've been strung along, used or charmed. And the answer is no to your question. It could go two ways. Get some messages for the collective, please. Someone needs to sort the life out and stop going round in circles. A choice is needing to be made. Stop procrastinating. Let's have a look. What's this self-sabotage about? What needs to stop? Clarify self-sabotage. We have ball balloon. Your problems will not last very long. And then we have Will with that one who has been away will return soon. So there could be someone, I was picking up on a reunion. It could be someone that sabotaged a connection and you went through problems. You need to know that the person is returning soon. It's clarifying what I was seeing with the candle flame. Um, a reunion after separation. There's a coming back together. Uh, clarify now is the answer to your question. What's this now in uh, regards to Spider web, pleasant happenings, and it was reversed. Someone could be thinking that something good is not going to happen. You need to know with that being in reversed, it is going to happen. It could be that you're sabotaging yourself as well. That could be two separate messages. Someone could be sabotaging themselves with um, lack mindset, negative thinking. You need to flip your thinking around because there is pleasant, pleasant happenings that are wanting to come in. But it could be your negative thinking or your lack mindset that's stopping this. Clarify two face, talk behind your back. Squares a need for caution. Be careful of the people you surround yourself with. Friends, family, co-workers. There's a lot of backstabbing that's going on. Um, you need to cleanse your aura and your space. But I want to clarify you've been strung along, used or charmed. A trip of disappointment. So someone could be feeling disappointed that you have been strung along, used or charmed by another person. Or it could be like I said, someone is thinking this, that you've been strung along. There has been disappointment. For some, no, you haven't been strung along. For others, yes, you have. And you're very disappointed. There could be a trip that's taken as well. Where it'll end up in a disappointment. I don't know if someone's going to meet someone um, for a date. It could be that the other person doesn't show up. And then we have a surprise is in store for you. And that's on sort your life out, stop going round in circles. So I feel once a cycle is closed out, you've got a surprise coming in for you. Let's clarify your choices needing to be made. We've got umbrella in reverse, trouble, trouble is coming. With this, I'm getting some kind of avoidance. Someone needs to stop pro uh, procrastinating. Someone needs to pull the red out of the dirt when it comes to trouble around you. Something can be avoided if you just make that choice. Let me just get some more. Give me some more messages. Please. Secret admirer from the past, a missed opportunity. 
The past is coming back. Get ready. I can't make this up. And troubles, troubles will vanish. Peace is coming in. So we are in Mercury retrograde. So for some, the past is coming back for lessons to be learned. Cycles to be closed out. But it could also bring someone back from a missed opportunity as well. Someone who sabotaged something. But overall, troubles will vanish. Peace is coming in. Let's have a look. Lion, an unpleasant situation is de uh, developing. This could be regarding someone from the past. There could be a Leo or it could be happening in Leo season, which is, I always say, August. Let's have a look. Here, be alert for an opportunity to advance in your work. There could be an unpleasant situation that's developing around um, the work area for some. But someone could hear of a new opportunity. This could be a promotion that you go for. And it could be others that are jealous, that are causing problems for you, or just being not really nice to you because you want to advance in your career. And then we have arrow, direction, focus. Yeah, someone's moving in a different direction. It could be that you're moving away from all the unpleasant unpleasantness sorry that's been happening around you there's definitely a new direction that someone will be going someone's life starting over for the better something new beginning we have pants you will be tempted and clouds someone or someone threatens you let's have a look and then we have leaves and i heard uh, when the leaves start to bloom, fertility, energy, nature, things will be changing soon. There could be someone from the past that tempts another person back as well. And it, it could cause some disappointment or some kind of unpleasantness. This could be with a Leo. For others, there is something or someone that's threatening you. They could be threatening your relationship. Um, you could be in a relationship and there's someone else that's trying to tempt your partner. But you need to know, whatever it is, things will be changing soon. Let me see if any um, star signs come out with this, because I've got Leo and Earth. I'll say Earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Speak up, things need saying. Someone got ghosted. Balance is needed with some kind of obsession as well. I do feel there's an obsessive person coming back for someone. And I feel as if you don't want to hear from this person. Can I get some star signs? way too many any star signs we've just got time to rest heal could be a vacation yes is the answer to your question so if anybody's got any questions regarding something the answer is yes but this is also clarifying that yes it is time to rest it is time to heal from something that you've been going through that's been very unpleasant a leap of faith is needed you could be an aries dealing with an aries or a virgo i feel this leap of faith is needed though into something new, into these changes that are wanting to happen. Got a couple more. Someone can't stop thinking about you. There's definitely someone coming in from the past. They could reach out. There could be a message. Someone could also be copying and reporting someone's social media as well. This could be the um, someone that's threatening you in some way. And then at the bottom of the deck, we've got money material world will get better. Uh, no star signs have come out, but I've seen Leo uh, with leaves. I'm seeing Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. With the umbrella, I'd say air signs, uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The same for the, um, the aeroplane. The wheel, Leo, Taurus, Aries, Aquarius, Scorpio. But if I haven't mentioned your signs, don't worry about it. The messages are there. So I'm going to leave that there and I hope that helps. And thank you all for watching.